An article in Stuff this morning is talking about how much bowel cancer rates are rising in younger people. But I'm really surprised by what they chose to include in this. I've talked before about how to look for suspect signs in the media. The crux of it is bowel cancer cases are massively spiking in younger people. We don't know why. It seems very strange. There must be something environmental that's doing it. The scientists quoted say that they don't know what it is yet, but they've got a couple of suspicions. One of them is microplastics. The other is sugary drinks. But what really puzzles me about it is they've not mentioned any of the things that we do know cause bowel cancer that have been on the increase in that same period of time. One of the researchers quoted is studying the impact of microplastics on intestinal cells, which is interesting. It's certainly not showing any kind of causality at this point. High levels of nitrates in water, like in lots of our fresh water, has pretty strong links to a high incidence of bowel cancer. Not mentioned. They don't talk about the massively increased risk if you are obese. Guess what's happened to obesity rates in the last 60 years? It doesn't talk about things like sedentary lifestyle. They don't talk about fiber at all, which is hugely important. In America, 95% of people do not hit the recommended daily intake of fiber. If there is one thing that you can do today to improve your health, it is eat at least the recommended amount of fiber. Scientists have an idea of the many different things that seem to contribute to a higher incidence of bowel cancer. Yet they've kind of flagged the ones that we don't have as strong evidence for. You can't avoid microplastics. They are ubiquitous. They found them in our bones the other day. Bonus points if you ditch any sugary drinks, energy drinks, those sorts of things, because the more and more scientists study those, the more and more they seem way worse for you than we think.